Hey guys, now we have, do you have a new computer? Well, here's the number one reason why you should not buy a new computer. Do you have a slow computer? Do not buy a new PC or call a PC repair company. One simple tip is saving people across the globe thousands of dollars. Your computer is not made to last long, that's a fact. Most people do not like to hear this. But the reality is, PC retailers and software companies need a reason for users to keep buying upgrades, otherwise they simply won't make money. But now that the secret is revealed, an in-light team of Microsoft Gold Search Certified developers have created a better solution for the average user. It's a new software that operates using a high-performance algorithm to scan your Windows, PC, or laptop. It then identifies and clears out unnecessary files that cause slow performances, all at a touch of a button. <coughs> Literally, anyone can use it and can only take five minutes to work. Many people feel ripped off by not knowing this one simple trick. Many users are even saying that their computers is ruining faster than the day it was new, immediately after using the tool. As one person said, it's like a turbocharge for your computer. The person responsible for this want to get it into as many homes as possible. So as part of their strategy, they're given away their analysis toll for free. Until, until September 16, 2015, you can grab a free copy by clicking here, if it's available. Technical Direct John Haynes says, our launch strategy is pretty simple. Give the basic product away to as many users as possible. Once they use it and see the results, the product will sell itself. They'll tell their friends, they'll continue to lose it, to use it, and we'll see a viral growth effect. First, you download and install the Turbo your PC. Second, Turbo PC will scan your computer, and third, it will find arrows that slow down your PC. He continues, it really is a no-brainer. People love the tool. It's easy to use. It may, it works immediately, and it's saving people across the globe hundreds of, or thousands, even thousands of dollars in unnecessary repair or upgrade costs. The feedback has been really overwhelming and so positive. Once people see it for themselves, the product will promote itself. That's the beauty of creating a product that solves a problem millions of people experience every day. One user told us, my computer would take what seemed like an entire eternity just to start my web browser. <coughs> Immediately after I scanned my machine and repaired the arrows, it loads up in seconds. I didn't realize how much time it was costing me. But now my old machine is running faster than ever. And the difference is like uh, night and day. So is Microsoft really conspiring up to force people to upgrade by building systems that are designed to fail over time. We can't confirm or deny that, but we can confirm that before you shell out a fortune on new equipment or specialists, you should definitely download Turbo your PC and give it a try. Here's what you need to know. More and more people are using Turbo your PC instead of spending $150,000 an hour for PC repair or $1,000 for a new machine. Right now you can download the diagnostic tool for free by clicking here. If you like what you see, you'll have the option to upgrade to the premium version, which, st which is starting at $8.95. It's a bargain compared to the alternatives. You should keep this software installed and run scan about every 30, second, 30 days to maintain peak performance. Many users don't realize how much faster their machine could be until the, after they run the repair tool. Was I? Our recommendation, even if you didn't, don't think your computer is running slow, grab Turbo to your chat PC. While they're still offering the free an analysis tool, run the scanner and see for yourself. It'll show you an, any arrows that are slowing your system down. And once they're fixed, you may be amazed at just how fast your computer really can be. Click here to download your Turbo, Turbo your PC. While they're still Offering the free analysis, the promotion ends on September 16th, 2015. So grab it while you can. <coughs> well, what I normally do is, um, this happened to me like I think two months ago. I had my computer and it was acting very slow. So what I did is I pressed um, the power. I pressed 11, F11, and all it does is it reboots the computer and it deletes everything. But when I once I got it, it was really much better. I mean, my connection is literally better it doesn't go slow the only thing that I do recommend is do not use um, internet browser you know what's it called I'm trying to think of what it's called 
Um, but if you're a computer person, do not use um, Internet Explorer or Mozilla Explorer because Internet Explorer takes you forever. Like Google Chrome is my number one place to go. I click on it; it's automatically. It can record, store anything. It has some nice stuff in it. But um, talking about computers is um, really fun. Um, if you have a tablet, it's way different. I have a cell phone and it has internet and it's way better than a computer. Computers are the same thing as phones, but instead of phones, phones you take pictures and if you have if you are a photo person, um a selfie person, take some pictures and connect it to um if you are signed into Google, all you need to do is sign into your Google and it will save all your photos. So I'm basically a genius at this. So if you have any questions, just ask me. Um, stuff that you do not want to download. I would say IMVU because it has a lot of viruses. Um, I'm trying to think of what else is a virus. Oh, that's game. Um. What was that game? Oh. A skateboard game. When you see if it's a... <coughs> I, I forgot what it was called. Yeah, Wizard 101. Wizard 101. Some, some Wizard 101. Um, it has viruses because um, you're connecting to it, so I don't know. Vampire 101. <coughs> Vampire 101. No, Pirates. Pirates 101. Yeah, it, Club Penguin. I don't know why, but it says it has no virus. So whatever you do, do not go on it because if you go on it, you can like literally, like, I don't know. But um, this was as seen on CNN, ABC, NBC, CBS News, and Fox News. But whatever you do, I learned this because this is my third computer. Um, do not download anything. Like, if it says, you have to make sure because, like, like, um, I wish I could show you, but I can't. <coughs> if it has, um, it says restart now, restart it then because you want to get, um, new data database. Um, one thing that you need to re really work out on is, um, what you save because whenever you save photos, um, if you save too many, you might not have space to, like, click on anything, so. The thing that I hated was IMVU. IMVU is, like, communicating with other people, but you have a avatar. Um, you create it and you do anything on there, but do not download IMVU because it has lots of viruses. It really does. Um, what else? Spotify. Now, Spotify is really good, but um, it takes a while. Um, Skype. Skype is a good source to use. I use Skype sometimes. Skype is when you interact with other people. Um, you connect with them. You um, chat with them. What else can I tell you guys? You guys get free games on here, but do not buy anything because it's a waste of money. I'm just giving you guys advice. All right, I'm going to try to find another article, hopefully on... Um, life. Um, hang on. But, um, yeah, I can say that once you have a computer, you're, like, obsessed with it. You're like, it's, this is my new best friend. But, sometimes when I go on YouTube, it doesn't, it says not do not, is not responding. So, when it does that, give it a couple of minutes, and um, it does that, so. One thing that I did learn from having my two computers is that do not download stuff. You have to read about it. You have to, like, visualize it. You can't just um, download anything, because when you download it, it, like, gets all the space. I don't know how many gigabytes this has, but I have an Toshiba. Um... I have a Toshiba um, computer, but Toshiba is really good. I've had this for like two years, I actually three. I don't know, but but coming up next, we have 15 celebrities that you forgot committed horrible. Um, but yeah, if you guys have any information about um.
computers, just ask me, or just comment on here. Um, yeah, I know everything about computers since I was little, so I'm a genius. Thank you guys so much for listening, and I have some news for you guys next on Celebrities. Thanks, guys. Bye.